Now, pension is a stated allowance or amount of money paid regularly on a monthly basis to a person on his retirement from service. Pensioners across Nigeria have been faced with financial challenges due to the delay and non-payment of their allowances by the government. This has put retirees across the country in a very insecure position where they sometimes regret serving their fatherland. They are abandoned to wallow in penury, sickness, hopelessness and regret upon retirement. For this reason, the federal government in August 2013 established the Pension Transitional Arrangement Directorate to solve all pension issues in the country. There's a need for the government to pay more attention to the welfare of the retired citizens with a view to making life bearable for them. Joining us to discuss this further is Mr. William Dogo, who is the National Coordinator of the Pension Transitional Arrangement Directorate. A warm welcome to you, to Thank News you. Across Nigeria. Thank you very much. So, after dedicating many years of their lives and service, why is it difficult to access their pensions? Well, uh, you are aware that uh, from a uh, few years ago, there have been problems of delay or non-payment of pension entitlements. And this has been largely because of uh, mismanagement of funds. As a result, so many were left unpaid. And that is why government established Pension Transitional Arrangement Directory through the uh, uh, reform, uh, Pension Reform Act of 2004, which is now 2014 to cater for the defined benefit scheme that is PITAT. And uh, PITAT, when it came on board, has uh, done her best to see that the, the pensioners' uh, 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 problems by paying these pensions. And that is why we need to have a credible database. And apart from that, having a credible database, we'll be able to compute their entitlement and pay them as when due. This is why we need to go into verification. And that was why PITAT embarked on verification since uh, 2014. Now, talking more about the verification exercise mm. now, of mm. course, you've mentioned some benefits, but what we've seen uh, instances where this exercise has been done more than once. Well, as I said before, it was done more than once. But right now, PITAS has started this verification, and this will involve the biometric capture of all the pensioners. It will also involve digitization of their employment records. It will involve authentication to let it uh, know the genuine pensioners, so that when we create a credible database, then we know that we have uh, cleaned up the, the system. And with that, we will now be able to do the computation for the entitlement. Right now, as I speak, we have done four zones across the country. And uh, we may invite you to know that about 18,000 of them who were not on payroll for several years have been put on payroll and all their pension arrears paid. Right now, we are in Lagos doing the verification to cover about 21,000 pensioners. And if you go to our center, you see that the verification is uh, seamless. Is the process is uh, so good. Pensioners are taken, they are well seated. They are taken care of. They are being fed uh, uh, food. They are supplied with food. And uh, we are assuring you within the next three to four, years, four months, uh, those who are not on payroll will, will bring hope to, their, to, to them by putting them back on the payroll and also their arrears being paid. Thank you very much for your time, Mr. William Dogo, who is the National Coordinator of the Pension Transitional Arrangement Directorate. Thank you.